Bison are large bovines in the genus Bison within the tribe Bovini. Two extant and numerous extinct species are recognized. Of the two surviving species, the American bison, v. bison, found only in North America, is the more numerous. Although colloquially referred to as a buffalo in the United States and Canada, it is only distantly related to the true buffalo. The North American species is composed of two subspecies, the plains bison, v. b. bison, and the wood bison, v. b. Athabasca, which is the namesake of Wood Buffalo National Park in Canada. A third subspecies, the eastern bison, v. b. Pennsylvanicus, is no longer considered a valid taxon, being a junior synonym of b. b. bison. References to Woods bison, or Wood bison, from the eastern United States refer to this subspecies, not b. b. Athabasca, which was not found in the region. The European bison, b. Bonasus, or Wisent, or Zuber, or colloquially European buffalo is found in Europe and the Caucasus, reintroduced after being extinct in the wild. While bison species have been traditionally classified in their own genus, modern genetics indicates that they are nested within the genus Bos, which includes, among others, cattle, yaks and gaur, being most closely related to yaks. Bison are sometimes bred with domestic cattle and produce offspring called beefalo or zubron. The bovine tribe, Bovini, split about 5 to 10 million years ago into the buffaloes, Bubalus and Cincerus, and a group leading to bison and taurine cattle. Genetic evidence from nuclear DNA indicates that the closest living relatives of bison are yaks, with bison being nested within the genus Bos, rendering Bos without including bison paraphyletic. While nuclear DNA indicates that both living bison species are each other's closest living relatives, the mitochondrial DNA of European bison is more closely related to that of domestic cattle and aurochs, while the mitochondrial DNA of American bison is closely related to that of yaks. This discrepancy is either suggested to be the result of incomplete lineage sorting or ancient introgression. Bison are widely believed to have evolved from a lineage belonging to the extinct genus Leptobos during the late Pliocene to early Pleistocene in Asia. The earliest members of the bison lineage, known from the late Pliocene to early Pleistocene of the Indian subcontinent, Bison Sibilensis, and China, Bison Paleocenensis, approximately 3.4-2.6 million years ago, Ma, are placed in the subgenus Bison Eobison. The oldest remains of Eobison in Europe are those Bison Georgicus found in Demani C, Georgia, dated to around 1.76 Ma. More derived members of the genus are placed in the subgenus Bison, Bison, which first appeared towards the end of the early Pleistocene, around 1.2 Ma, with early members of the subgenus including the widespread Bison Shotensaki. The steppe bison, Bison Priscus, first appeared during the mid-middle Pleistocene in eastern Eurasia, and subsequently became widely distributed across Eurasia. During the late middle Pleistocene, around 195,000-135,000 years ago, the steppe bison migrated across the Bering Land Bridge into North America, becoming ancestral to modern American bison, as well as extinct forms such as the largest known bison, the long-horned bison latifrons, and the smaller bison anticus, which became extinct at the end of the late Pleistocene. Modern American bison are thought to have evolved from B. anticus during the late Pleistocene-Holocene transition via the intermediate form bison occidentalis. The European bison, bison bonasus, first appeared in Europe during the late middle Pleistocene, where it existed in sympatry with the steppe bison. Its relationship with other extinct bison species is unclear, though it appears to be only distantly related to the steppe and American bisons, with possibly some interbreeding between the two lineages during the Middle Pleistocene. The steppe bison survived into the early mid-Holocene in Alaska Yukon and eastern Siberia, before becoming extinct. During the population bottleneck, after the great slaughter of American bison during the 19th century, the number of bison remaining alive in North America declined to as low as 541. During that period, a handful of ranchers gathered remnants of the existing herds to save the species from extinction. These ranchers bred some of the bison with cattle in an effort to produce, cattalo, today called, beefalo. Accidental crossings were also known to occur. Generally, male domestic bulls were crossed with bison cows, producing offspring of which only the females were fertile. The crossbred animals did not demonstrate any form of hybrid vigor, so the practice was abandoned. 
Wisent American bison hybrids were briefly experimented with in Germany, and found to be fully fertile, and a herd of such animals is maintained in Russia. A herd of cattle Wisent crossbreeds, Zubron, is maintained in Poland. First-generation crosses do not occur naturally, requiring caserine delivery. First-generation males are infertile. The U.S. National Bison Association has adopted a code of ethics that prohibits its members from deliberately crossbreeding bison with any other species. In the United States, many ranchers are now using DNA testing to cull the residual cattle genetics from their bison herds. The proportion of cattle DNA that has been measured in intergressed individuals and bison herds today is typically quite low, ranging from 0.56 to 1.8 percent. There are also remnant purebred American bison herds on public lands in North America. Herds of importance are found in Yellowstone National Park, Wind Cave National Park in South Dakota, Blue Mound State Park in Minnesota, Elk Island National Park in Alberta, and Grasslands National Park in Saskatchewan. In 2015, a purebred herd of 350 individuals was identified on public lands in the Henry Mountains of southern Utah via genetic testing of mitochondrial and nuclear DNA. This study, published in 2015, also showed the Henry Mountains bison herd to be free of brucellosis, a bacterial disease that was imported with non-native domestic cattle to North America. In 2021, the American Society of Mammalogists considered bison to be a subgenus, and placed both bison species back into boss. Wallowing is a common behavior of bison. A bison wallow is a shallow depression in the soil, either wet or dry. Bison roll in these depressions, covering themselves with mud or dust. Possible explanations suggested for wallowing behavior include grooming behavior associated with molting, male-male interaction typically rutting behavior, social behavior for group cohesion, play behavior, relief from skin irritation due to biting insects, reduction of ectoparasite load, ticks and lice, and thermoregulation. In the process of wallowing, bison may become infected by the fatal disease anthrax, which may occur naturally in the soil. Bison temperament is often unpredictable. They usually appear peaceful, unconcerned, even lazy, yet they may attack anything, often without warning or apparent reason. They can move at speeds up to 56 km per hour, 35 miles per hour, and cover long distances at a lumbering gallop. Their most obvious weapons are the horns borne by both males and females, but their massive heads can be used as battering rams, effectively using the momentum produced by what is a typical weight of 900 to 1,200 kilograms, 2,000 to 2,700 pounds, moving at 50 kilometers per hour, 30 miles per hour. The hind legs can also be used to kill or maim with devastating effect. In the words of early naturalists, they were dangerous, Savage animals that feared no other animal and in prime condition could best any foe, except for wolves and brown bears. As of July 2015, an estimated 4,900 bison lived in Yellowstone National Park, the largest U.S. bison population on public land. During 1983-1985 visitors experienced 33 bison-related injuries, range equals 10 to 13 per year, so the park implemented education campaigns. After years of success, Five injuries associated with bison encounters occurred in 2015, because visitors did not maintain the required distance of 75 feet, 23 meters, from bison while hiking or taking pictures.